Hey, hey, system coach, how are you guys doing? It's me, Johnny Sports, and welcome back to the World Cup Road to Glory episode 4, boys. First of all, I just want to go ahead and say this. Yesterday's episode was 45 minutes long and it was so long because I um, basically had to make up for the fact that the day before we did not upload the Road to Glory for the World Cup. I really want to try and upload this series every single day and I have made that my number one target. So the fact that so many of you guys were in the comments down below saying that you loved the fact that this video was very long, like especially this guy right here, Mercurial Racer, he says, who else loves these 40 plus minute videos from Johnny and then had a lot of likes. I really, really appreciate all of you guys loving this series so far and has it, it again has over 2,700 likes. This is amazing, guys. I am addicted to this series already. I can't wait to play for the next episode, but I always wait to see what you guys are saying in the comments down below, and then I go ahead and record the episode. So thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart, man, for the support on this series. It really means the world to me. We are getting a lot of new subscribers into the channel as well due to this series, and that is very nice to see. That is exactly what I tried to achieve, to reach out to even more people so thank you guys so much and if you are still enjoying this series man please go ahead and hit that like button every single episode so far has been over 2500 likes and if we can hit that again today that would be beautiful today our number one target will be the thing that everyone has been talking about in the comments down below the fact that I am yet to win an online tournament and that is my number one target today boys hopefully we can win the online tournament get ourselves the 15,000 coins and do a foot draft maybe or just go ahead and open packs I kind of feel like opening packs is a little bit more fun I don't know I just kind of feel like the opening packs thing in the World Cup mode is something that is a lot of fun now you guys in the last episode had to decide which team should I go with? Option one included Cavani in the starting lineup. Option number two included included Viana in the starting lineup. And that is what you guys wanted. Option number two was the most commented in the comments down below. So thank you guys so much for letting me know which team I should be using. And I kind of feel like this team is going to be great, especially with the wingers here, with Nabri and Martial with lots of pace, skill moves, and then Eriksen in the middle with the five star weak foot, great passing play, great shooting. He will be an amazing, amazing center attacking midfielder. We'll be using him for the first time today uh, because we packed him in the last episode. If you guys haven't see seen that one, go ahead and check it out. And then we have Werner in the striking position, who I'm really excited about because every time someone on Twitter says, who is who are the best players that you used so far who are the best strikers you used so far and then you see most of the people obviously commenting ronaldo and so on the big players that are the obvious choices but then lots of people in their comments are also saying Vienna is an amazing player and i cannot wait to use him this is going to be the team that hopefully takes us quite far in the online tournament also one more thing that i'm kind of hoping for is that ea will be bringing out a couple more squad building challenges some live content if you know what i mean like uh, squad building challenges that you can only do like for one or two days i think that might start happening though as soon as the world cup starts i think that's how it got how it's gonna be and uh, i'm really looking forward to that one so let's see what kind of content they can come up with another thing is that apparently the packs both of these packs have 13 uh, cards in there. Players in this game mode are all non-rares. Every single player apparently is a non-rare in this one. So you can get fooled by going ahead and opening this pack, the premium pack, while you could just go ahead and open the standard pack as well. The thing is, you have three World Cup players in a standard pack and the other one you have five. That's the only difference in between these. Do not get fooled by the fact that it says rare and only one rare right there. They're like you have three rares here and then only one rare right there. That doesn't make a difference apparently. That's what my chat told me in my last Twitch stream. So if you guys are putting coins into this one, I would just go ahead and uh, open for the 5k packs if you are on a limited amount of coins. If you have a huge amount of coins, go ahead and open the premium packs. That's what I did on my uh, second account and I have like 150 packs ready for the ultimate team this season. Oh God, we need to do that pack opening today, live on stream. Oh, cool. As you can tell though, we are currently on 1,760 coins. And one thing that I've been seeing a lot, I think Nepenthes talked about this on Twitter, was that if you just play 
until you make it out of the group stages and then just forfeit to tournament and do it again. That's the best way to do it. So if you basically win the first two games, you can go ahead and forfeit the next game, which then still gets you into the next round, which means you get two single player packs and no, sorry, three single player packs and a uh, premium. No, not three, actually two single player packs because you played first two games to the end. The third one you rage quit, so you do not get a pack for that one. But with six points, you will be making it into the next round, which means you get yourself a premium players pack. So a premium pack, basically, not, not a players pack. So you get two and then another big pack. I think that's probably the way to go because the round of 16 only gets you a single player pack. The uh, quarterfinals only gets you a single player pack. The uh, semifinals, again, only a single player pack. And then the final, only if you do win the final, you get some great rewards. But is it worth the time and effort? I don't think so. I think it's a lot smarter to play two games in the group stages, try and win both of them, rage quit the third one, get yourself the packs, forfeit the tournament, start again. I think that's the best way to stack up packs. Here is our first opponent in the group stages, boys. He has a great team. Um, his defense is looking very good. He has De Gea, he has Blanc, he has uh, Walker. And then in the attack, he has Lukaku and Eriksen. Eriksen will be playing against us, but also he'll be playing for us for the first time. That Blanc must be amazing. Sadly, we didn't pull a sick icon. A lot of people are saying that I should use Yashin. Guys, trust me. Um, Tastegan is a cheat code, man. He is way too good in this game. Eriksen, beautiful. Nabri, good pass. Viana, beautiful. Into Eriksen again. Eriksen, played back. Beautiful goal. That was great passing play in between both of the debutants, boys. We are 1-0 up in the 13th minute. Eriksen is apparently the captain of this team now. I mean, sure, why not? He's the highest rated one. Awful pass, though, from me there. Messed it up completely. Here goes Lukaku in the middle. That is going to be a goal. That is way too easy. I open up the spaces and then I realized Lukaku was running through. I was concentrating on the guy on the wing, but I shouldn't have done that. I should have focused on the guy in the middle. Eriksen, beautiful run. Eriksen. Oh, there we go. It's the combo again. Eriksen with Werner. 2-1 straight back into the lead. Beautiful. This time Eriksen into Werner, oh no, Werner into Eriksen, <laughs> the other way around. This time Werner is the man assisting and the captain is scoring, which is nice to see. It seems like this formation is working for now, but I kind of feel like the wingers are not taking part in the attacks as much. I think that might be because I don't have instructions on them yet, so hopefully I remind myself of changing the instructions for our players, but Eriksen and Werner have been on fire, man. Great additions into the team. From the last episode into this one, our team has definitely improved a lot and is a lot more competitive with bigger sides. Werner, Eriksen, beautiful pass into Martial. Martial is now running through, passing it inside, passing it over, passing it over. And there goes the shot of Navri. And that is going to be the rage quit of our opponent, I believe. We are 4-1 up in the 55th minute. And Navri is getting onto the score sheet as well. Is it going to be a rage quit? Yes or no? Eriksen, what a beautiful pass. Wow, that was timed to perfection. These two, Werner and Eriksen, might just be the best partnership. That is insane. Look at this. Look at that pass from Werner into Eriksen. He turns around multiple times knowing that there's no space, finds the space, and then Eriksen, calm and collected. What a finish. Ooh, that was a sick pass. That was a really good pass. 5-3, man. Gotta get some people in front of Lukaku. Blanc plays the ball out. Ball is coming in once again. The shot, and it's a goal. He actually brings it back to 5-4. What a ridiculous game this has turned out to be. Now, at least, let's get those three points, man. This guy has turned, like, I've kind of felt like I've been playing against a little brother for the first half. And then for the second half, all of a sudden, his big bro was like, you know what, let me just play this one. You suck at FIFA. And there we go. That is going to be the end, boys. It is three points, but kind of disappointing that I conceded four goals. Uh, 
I definitely need uh, better center backs, man. My center backs are just so slow. I can't cope with any attacks. Next round opponent or next group stage match opponent will be this one right here. Apart from that Ronaldo, which he got really lucky with in the icon pack. My God, the luck, man. Imagine getting yourself 94 Ronaldo. Oh God, why are people so lucky, man? I want to have this luck as well with the icon pack. I get the worst one. Nothing against Yashin boys, but let's be real, man. I would have much preferred a goalkeeper, a, a, a player outside of the goalkeeping position. Eriksen, pass into Vanna. Vanna turns back, turns back again. Vanna with some space. Finesse from outside the box. Yes! Beautiful goal from Vanna. I didn't really have an option to play the pass, so I decided to just go for it. And for the first time in the World Cup mode, I've actually finished a finesse shot from outside the box. It feels like finesse shots are not as effective in this game mode. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down below. Let me know if you guys have actually uh, been able to pull off some finesse shots from outside the box with some higher rated players probably. Oh, 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 that is a goal, that is a goal. I kind of felt it coming there. I knew that my defense was not rightly positioned. Ah, Rodrigo with his right foot. I think he has a three-star weak foot. That's quite impressive from Rodrigo. Oh, no. R9, oh, wow. That... That was a sick goal. Let's be real. That was a very nice goal with R9. I did not expect that skill move at all in that moment. Come on, Abri. Come on, Abri. Beautiful. We're back into it. Great attack there. I took my time. I kind of knew that he would slide tackle there if I did fake the shot with Nabri. Luckily, he does have a four-star weak foot as far as I remember. Otherwise, I don't think I would have scored that one easily. Come on, Martial. You got this, Martial. Four-star weak foot. Oh, that is a terrible, terrible attempt at a save from the goalkeeper. But we are 3-2 up, and that's the only thing that matters right now. Great play there from Martial. Puts it into the back of the net. Nabi took his time. Viana gets the assist. Toliso, jump up, mate. Beautiful. Beautiful. I see Viana making that run. What a pass that is from Martial into Viana. Viana. Turns around, twice, plays the ball. Martial plays it back. Eriksen finishes it right before half time. Wow, I am so impressed. I, I do definitely feel a massive difference in gameplay from World Cup mode to regular Ultimate Team, man. There is such a huge gap in the way the players behave, in the way that tackles come in, in the way your players get past players. I, I kind of really dig it. I hope that FIFA 19 will be similar, more similar to the World Cup than it is to regular regular Ultimate Team because it's different, man. And I, I like having to adapt to gameplay every single year. I like that. Martial. <laughs> oh, God. The pass. The pass from Vanna is incredible, boys. And you know what? Do I go for the final or do I try and win this one or do I just do what I need to do in order to get packs? Guys, you know what? I think first of all what we need to do is to get a really good team together. A really, really good team. And in order to do that, I think the best thing I can possibly do is going to be trying ahead, uh, trying and going ahead and getting these packs right now by playing the group stages, finishing them, backing out, playing the group stages. So we'll do it twice in today's episode and uh, we'll see what we get at the end with the packs is it worth it yes or no that answer will be coming in at the end of this video not the end but towards the middle end part so here is our next opponent uh, he is going to get an easy victory right here boys we are gifting him a victory and then running through into the next round that is what we will be doing right now i hope he's happy enjoy enjoy buddy i really hope you can uh, use those three points to go through into the next round for yourself as well. We are basically helping out someone else and helping ourselves out at the same time. So I kind of feel like this is what I need to do. I feel like this is what we go ahead and do most of the time. Try and get through the group stages, get those packs. You know what? I can't wait. 
<laughs> I can't wait. We'll open these right now, and then we'll open the rest, uh, the next ones uh, after the next tourney run. So let's go ahead and get a single player pack going. Are we getting any boards? We are not getting boards on the first single player pack. As long as it is a center back with pace, I'll take him. We get Tadic. Okay, it's a European player on a high rating. I like that. Next one. I don't feel like this one will be bored either, but let's see how this goes. No boards, that's fine. We hope to get boards from the premium players pack. If the premium players pack doesn't have boards, that's gonna be sad. But we get Dinier. He is a decent left back, but I think Rose is the better one right now. And here's the pack. So we basically played two games, got two single player packs and a premium pack. I genuinely do feel like it's worth it. But now, let's prove it by getting boards. Beautiful, we get two. What is it going to be? It is French Cam Fakir. Hey, I'll take a Fakir. I'll take a Fakir. That's beautiful. Let's get him right into the squad, boys. I, I mean, he won't be playing in a starting lineup, but he will be a great substitute. And we get Kovacic as well. A good center midfielder. We get a couple of good players here. We get five players, left wing to left mid, position modifier, two fitness cards. Guys, I think this is this is the way to go, man. If you want to play the World Cup mode most efficiently on a Road to Glory account, just go for the packs, boys. Just freaking go for the packs. Oh, I just realized I didn't forfeit the tournament. I only forfeited the third group stage match. Do I go for it, man? You know what? You guys wanted me to win this World Cup. You guys really wanted me to win this. I'll try. I'll try and win it. If I don't get it done, I'll do another group stage and get ourselves a couple more packs. But from this point on, for three matches, so the uh, quarterfinal, the round of 16, quarterfinal, and also the, um, what is it? Round of 16, quarterfinal, and the semifinal. My god, <laughs> my brain had just a big brain fart there. Um, we'll be going for single player packs and we'll be coming up against teams like this. That is an insane team. He has Neymar, he has the front three of Brazil basically. Uh, okay, he has Paulinho, Ronaldinho, Nakata. Hmm, this is gonna be interesting. We'll bring it back to Ericsson. Toliso is continuing his run. Toliso known to score goals for us and he starts off straight away. In the sixth minute, we do take... Oh, actually, sorry, that's Kedira. That is actually Kedira. I genuinely thought it was Toliso there. That is a nice shot from Kedira. I think that's his first goal for us. Verna, beautiful. Nabri is through. Nabri, get in there, son. Nabri, easy finish. In the 17th, we go up 2-0. Looks like we might be going through into the quarterfinals here. Verna is through. What a pass that is into Timo Verna. Let's finish it, son. Let's finish it. That is 3-0 in the 26th minute. Our opponent is yet to give up, though. He hasn't given up. And Verna and Eriksen, man. The players, this, this team, you guys have decided to play with this team. It's definitely a lot better than the team that we had before. So thank you so much for suggesting it, guys. Beautiful. Get in there. Martial, I need you. Martial, Martial, oh boy, I feel bad for my opponent, it's 4-0 in the round of 16, and I think he might just be rage quitting right now, boys. Beautiful, Test again, very nice. Eriksen is making that run through, boys. Eriksen on the run through with the pass over to Werner, and what a header. That was nearly a header from outside the box. And Timo Werner still somehow manages to get that one in. That's, that is impressive. That is very impressive. Timo Werner. Oh boy, what a striker. Now finally our opponent has actually backed out. In uh, the half time, he is backing out. And we are through into the quarterfinals. Is this the run to win the tournament? I really hope so. 15,000 coins, man. That would be great. That's the only incentive, really, to go for this. Because otherwise, you just go for the group stages and that's about it. But we are currently in the quarterfinal. Our record is not looking too bad, you know. Our record is not looking too bad. Um, let's go ahead and play this one as well. The, the fitness should be enough. I think it should be fine. Please, please, give us another okay opponent no one overpowered please here we go then he is oh god he has the two highest rated center backs in the game i think ramos and pepe apart from the icons he has goretzka mateus Mertens, Eriksen, henri 
Oi, 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 oi. Annie is playing in the 4 2 2 2 2. I think this is a really good FIFA player, boys. We are dropping out of the quarterfinals. Timo Verna. Timo Verna gets in there. Timo will stop now. Still on the ball. Great stuff from Timo. Get in there. Pass it in. Beautiful. We are taking a lead, actually. Okay. He might not be that good. Who knows, man? Let's not let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Let's think this guy's amazing and try our absolute best. Oh no. No, Henri. What? Ref, come on. That's not a pen. That is just not a pen. I got the ball, man. I legit touched the ball. Okay, he's getting a penalty, boys. Let's see what he's doing. He's aiming down the bottom left right now. And we got it. He was aiming down the bottom left, and we got it done, boys. Beautiful. No! Oh, no, no, no. I knew it. As soon as he turned around. Wow, he's dabbing. Okay. One of the tall boys, please. Jump it! Ericsson! Well, buddy, take that dab, please. Enjoy it. Timo! Sue! Shh, what up? Dab, 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 dab. Oh no, look at his luck. No, he gets another penalty. <laughs> this man is getting so lucky. Oh god. Let's see where his penalty goes this time. He's looking to the right this time, boys. He's looking to the right. Unlucky. Oh no, come on. Come on, I saved the penalty. It goes straight into him. Really? Beautiful passing play here. Beautiful. Di Maria. Di Maria. Angel Di Maria to finish it off. 4-2. Come on. We're scoring loads and loads of goals. We just need to be better defensively. But I'm kind of limited with my players at the moment. I just can't chase anyone down apart from uh, Danny Rose. Danny Rose is the only one that has pace. Anyone else in my defense, including Kimmich, doesn't really have the most amount of pace. So they're not really that competitive with the likes of Henri and so on when my opponents have them. So I'm really forced to put them into the right position before they even run at me. No, 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 no. I did bottle it. Last minute, man. Last minute, I freaking bottled it. Oh, I saved it. <laughs> yes. I saved it in the end. That is so, so lucky. I saved it there, boys. On the line. Put my player there. Whew. That was intense. That was way too intense. We got it done, though. Okie dokie. Semi-final opponents. It is another really, really good team, especially his centre-backs, man. He has Varane and Amtiti. Viana will be struggling against those. And he also has De Gea in goal. Goretzka in the middle. Lots of people saying he's overpowered in this game mode. Hazard up top. Ooh, okay. 4-1-2-1-2, though. Which means we can use, we can abuse the wings. Okay, seems like the kickoff is a, thing, is a thing in World Cup mode. Great, great, man. Great. Kickoff glitch is a thing in World Cup mode. I can't believe that this is still in the game, man. <laughs> Bro, really? Really? Really, man? Come on! What the hell, man? Nah, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done, boys. I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to try and play. I mean, look at that goal that we can see now. It's going through the legs of my keeper. <laughs> oh boy, that is it for me. That is it for me. I. I don't want to ruin my mood, man. I genuinely do not want to ruin my mood. We lose in the semi-finals once again. We got two packs right here from the single player. Um, let's open them up right now. Let's see what we get. Can we get ourselves boards? No, the first one is not boards. I'm just hoping for center backs, man. I genuinely just need center backs. I, I'm, I'm sick and tired of my slow ass Rami there. He's just not good enough. And again, we get no boards, which is fine. I don't mind. We can put these players into SPCs later on, so that's okay. We get Davis, a 63 rated player. And now we'll be opening a standard pack and seeing if they are actually just as good as the premium ones. Can we get boards? We do get boards. Beautiful. Okay. What is it going to be? Argentina. Cam. Oh, 
Oh! Yes! <laughs> Come on! What a pull! Forget about that semi-final. I don't care. That is an amazing player to pack. But how do I put him into my team? How do I work this around? Oh, God. I have no clue how to put Dybala into our squad, boys. I genuinely don't know. Ugh. That is a sick pull. That is an amazing pull. I think that has to be the best pull so far. I mean, nothing against Eriksen, but I think Dybala with his pace is a bit more valuable than an Eriksen. But again, the weak foot is not that great, but Dybala in the center attack in midfield position. What a player. We have just packed ourselves, man. That is huge. That is incredible. I'm so happy about that. I am so freaking happy. Forget about the fact that we lost that World Cup tournament once again. We just can't get past people in the later rounds. I don't know why. But that guy that I just played against, it was just too much AIDS to start off with. Uh, first goal, AIDS. Second goal, I would take that as my mistake. Third goal, AIDS. <laughs> okay, now, since we have gotten ourselves Dybala, I think actually doing a South America upgrade would be worth it a bit more. I need a centre-back, though. I need a centre-back for my team. We are going for the Europe upgrade, boys. These players are being sent away. Come on, give us, please, please... Give me a centre-back. Just someone that I can put into my team. Apart from Rami or Sule. Our defence is just not competitive at the moment. Let's jump right in there. Let's open this pack and hope for the best. Please, centre-back, 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 centre-back. It's not even boards. Oh boy, that is not good. But please give me a good centre-back. Someone that can play there. We get a goalkeeper. That is unfortunate, guys. We get Selikov, 77 rated. I don't expect to see a high rated centre-back in there. We get Livermore, we get Teton, that's about it. That is sad. That Europe upgrade was the worst one we had so far. So we are going straight back into the World Cup online tournament. But this time around, guys, we are going to be farming packs. That is it. That is exactly what we will be doing. And then hopefully we can pack ourselves some decent players. So two single player packs and a premium pack per run in the group stages. That is what we are going for. Verna, what a pass again. Verna is on fire, man. Verna is the best player I've used so far on the World Cup mode. It's unbelievable. More impressive than his shooting is his passing. Every pass that he plays through the lines of the defense is just so accurate. With his left foot or right foot, it doesn't matter. Oh, pen, 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 pen. That is an obvious pen. And a red card as well. Okay, we'll take that. Jamir Ordain, never heard of him. He's going off the pitch, boys. Let's try and aim towards the bottom left and miss. That's what we do, boys. Great job. Okay, if I was him, I would rage quit after that. That was very, very disappointing. Oh, God. That was horrible from his keeper. That felt like a Cardius moment all over again. Eriksen left foot, it doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. And there we go. The first match in the group stages has been finished once again. A single player pack gained. One more game to go or one more win to go. Second group stage match. Finally, we are coming up against someone who doesn't have an overpowered team. But wow, that center back down the left has a huge head. Vienna. Eriksen. 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 Eriksson, easy. 13th minute, we take the lead right here. That was great play by Eriksson. He was thinking that I was shooting every single time I moved to the left to the right, and we got it done easy. One on one against the goalkeeper. There we go. Timo Werner on the run, boys. Timo Werner on the run. Timo Werner on the run. Timo Werner scores that. That was incredible. Boys. Second group match, straight away, it's a rage quit. I love it, saving myself some time. So that means the next match that we play, we'll just go ahead and rage quit out of it and get ourselves the three points, right? Here we go, buddy. Enjoy your victory. After rage quitting this one, we just conceded the goal, the own goal. Uh, we'll just go ahead 
and drop out of this tournament. We are getting ourselves 2,000 coins for whatever reason. We made it through into the next round. Oh, you get coins as well. I completely forgot. You get like 1,500 coins for making it through, right? I think that's how it works. So we'll be forfeiting this tournament right now. I want to improve my team before I go ahead and... Um, I, I need a center back, man. I, I definitely need some center backs. It kind of sucks that I haven't gotten someone proper so far. Uh, we have Jimenez, who is South America, though, so that doesn't work. So please, from these three packs, I'm just hoping for a center back. I don't want anything else, guys. Legit, nothing else. Chara. Okay. Second single player pack. Come on. Come on. Give us a center back. It's not boards again. Okay, so we can skip it. The skippity skip skip. And we get ourselves Mercado, a right back from South America as well. And then we'll go over into the premium pack, hoping to get ourselves a European center back. Come on, make it happen. We get boards. We get two boards. Even better, we get Brazil, right wing, Willian or Hulk. Hulk, the monster, is joining into our team. I like it. But I don't like it as much as packing a center back. <laughs> Please, for God's sake, EA, give me someone. Oh no, still no one that can play center back. And we are jumping right back in there. I'm doing it once again, trying to go for it again, boys. Let's do it. Come on, give me a center back, EA. Okie dokie, this opponent has a sick side. I see what you're doing, mate. De Gea, Omtiti, Pepe, Maradona, and so on. Okay. Maradona, 1-0. We start off really bad into this one. Kick off, kick off, kick off. Werner, beautiful finish. Werner is on the run, boys. Werner is on the run. Finish it. Yes, we are taking the lead. Come on, 2-1. Team of Werner, sprint unstoppable. That's a foul, thank you. Thank you, my friend. He has a rage credit of one half a second before the game actually ended. I'll take it, man. If he can't take a 2-1 loss, that's fine with me. Let's go ahead and see. Is this the second group match now? I've been playing FIFA for so long now. I've been playing for two hours already. I don't know. That was the first match. Okay, first match. Let's go ahead and play the second one as well. Second opponent has Pele. Apart from that, though, not the best of teams. Has Jack Wilshere in the left back position. I guess. Beautiful. Nice. Oh, nope. 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 What's going on here? That was one of the worst, worst goals that we have scored. There you go, bud. There you go. Enjoy your victory. And uh, yeah, that's about it. We go through into the next round, hopefully. Hopefully this guy doesn't get through. That would kind of suck. I, I haven't failed so far with a six points. So if that actually happens, that's probably quite rare. But I'll take it, man. I don't mind. We have enough coins right now. Oh, we do not have enough coins. We have 4,650. So we won't be able to open another pack from the store. But we have the two single player packs and the premium pack. Maybe for once, we do get lucky with the single player packs. No, we don't. We get ourselves yet again another non-board player. It is Trippier. Not a center back again. Right back though. Decent stats. Could make it into our team. Not Actually, no. Kimmich for sure. Here we go. Single player. Give us a board. Come on. We have opened a lot of single players lately without boards. And we get another one. Yet another one. Is it a center back though? It is a left mid. Don't need, no thank you. Now though, the premium pack and with that, that is going to be the episode boys. In this episode, we have run through lots and lots of games and we are managing to get ourselves only one board player, but what is it going to be? It is English, it is a cam, it is probably Dele Ali or Raheem Sterling. Yes, I like that. That is a great pull, but we already have so many center attacking midfielders. We have Eriksen, Sterling, Dybala, Fekir. Please give me a center back. Come on, an 80 rated center back. I'll take it. We, we do not get one. My God, that is ridiculous, man. We just are not getting one, right? 
I might do one Europe upgrade. We are doing one more Europe upgrade before we end this video, boys. Before we end this episode, we are hoping to get a center back. <laughs> Please, for God's sake, man. I really just want just a center back with above 65 pace. That's it. That's all I want. It doesn't need to be an amazing player right now. You don't need to give me Ramos. Just give... Oh, God. It's no boards. Ah, uh, it's no board. 74 is the highest rated player. That is such a disgrace. We get a center back with 48 pace, man. I'm stuck here with the worst defense. I can't. I can't change it up. <laughs> guys, let me know in the uh, let me know in the comments down below, guys. Do you think Going for the World Cup trophy, trying to make it into the final is worth it. Is it going to be worth it or is our team not good enough? Because I genuinely feel like at the moment, um, the fact that we have Rami with 55 pace and uh, Sule with 66, that is just not good enough to compete with all the insane strikers that players have, especially Rami. Sule at times is actually catching up to people, but Rami, it's just not working out. He's not agile, he's not fast, he's nothing. He is definitely not meta. And I kind of feel like until I get a proper center back, it's not worth for me to try and go ahead and get myself into the final. Because if I do so, I'll be playing against a really good player with probably a really good team who then just runs past my Rami and I just can't do anything against it. So let me know in the comments down below. Option one will be to try and go ahead and um, go through into the finals and try and win it with this team. Or option number two will be the way that we have been doing it in this episode. Do the two group stage matches, get, uh, get a, uh, forfeit the third match, get the premium players pack, get those two single players packs and use the coins that you have to open some more packs in the store to finally improve our team to a level where we can definitely compete for the final and try and go for the 15,000 coins and the premium pack and the single player pack as well that you get. But yeah, that's gonna be it for today, boys. A very big pull in Deep Bala. And I have used him, he does feel great. Um, we can link him up together with Di Maria and Cavani if we want to. But um, that is probably for the next episode. It all depends on what kind of players we'll be packing in the future. But this is our squad right now. I'm really happy with this squad. And Timo Werner is incredible, boys. 12 games, 10 goals, 14 assists, 12-7-7 for Eriksen. That is it for today, boys. Have a great day. See you tomorrow. Take care. Peace.